Hi everyone, my name is Anna and I'm the owner and operator of Halftime Physique Body Contouring. I thought I'd make a number of informational videos so that you as a consumer can become aware of the services we provide and make an informed decision about the treatments you would like to have done to your body. Now this video is sort of a precursor to a future video in which I will go over the actual booty building treatment and its procedure. I thought it was important to have this video first so that you could become aware of what was happening behind the scenes and how we get these permanent long-term results. So today we are going to talk about your booty. So your booty is compromised of three muscles. The first, which is the strongest and largest and tends to be the most typically visually dominant is the glute max. It gives you that shelf look. Now the glute max is responsible for movements like walking, sitting, and even keeping your posture erect. The second and third glute muscles are the glute mid and the glute min. They sit here on your thigh and are responsible for things like stability and lateral movements. Now because we don't go around crab walking everywhere, these muscles can be underdeveloped. An underdeveloped glute mid and glute min can lead to things like hip dips. These muscles are compromised of fibers, and these fibers are encased in something called fascia. I like to describe fascia as that thin layer of film you'll see on a raw chicken breast when you're cleaning it. That's what fascia is. Now, it's important to note that fascia can become tight and it can become dehydrated. When it is tight or dehydrated, it can theoretically restrict muscle growth, lead to pain and mobility issues. Now the actual muscle responds to stimulation. It's highly irritable. So what that means is when you put the muscle under stress, it will recruit additional muscle fibers to help it deal with it. Now, it's in the recruitment of those muscle fibers where you see the, that growth. So why is it important to know these things? Well, because the size of the cup, the placement of the cup and even the movement of the cup can determine the stimulation of the muscle and the fascia. Our goal is to create long lasting permanent booty gains. And one of the ways in which we achieve this is by stimulating the muscle and recruiting those fibers.